Elsie's by the briar patch, not far from here. I'll stop by and say hello. See how he's getting along. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> well, fuck me running. If it ain't Lincoln Clay. Surprised to see me, Alcee? Mm, I heard about Sammy and Ellis. Tough break. I guess you made it out okay. Speak of them once more, and I'll slice you from here to asshole. Let's go. We're taking a drive. Assuming I don't have a choice here. What do you think? <sighs> Lead the way.
motherfucker, you know I stayed away. I ain't stepped foot in the hollow since November of 62. Almost six years. I know. Can you at least tell me where we're going? The Acadia. It's where Tommy Marcano holds his jungle fights, right? It is. And you've been recruiting black fighters for him? I have. Good. Because I want in. What? Why? I wanted you to know I'd have told you. If I'm sticking my ass out like that, I need to know why. Motherfucker, you lucky to be alive after what you did to Sammy. You really think you wouldn't notice you stealing all that money? Look, I paid for that a hundred times over. Six years banished from the only place I ever call home. Christ, I couldn't even go see my mama on her deathbed. You made your choice. And now it's time to make another one. And I do this. You get a clean slate. Come and go through the hollow as you please. Fuck. Okay. I hear if you win out, Tommy meets you in person. That true? He likes the size of the winners. See if there's someone he wants to bring on regular. Or if they're just a one-time deal. Where's this happen? Usually up there in his office. One of his guys will meet you in the locker room after the fight. He'll take you to time it. All right. Fighters don't take the front entrance. We go in through the side door. Hold up, Alcee. Who the fuck's this? This? This is Jack Knapp Johnson. What's he here for? Fuck you mean, what he here for? We here to fight, boy. Gotta search him. No weapons allowed. If you change your mind, come on by. Do what you gotta do. Watch where you put your hands, motherfucker. Save it for the ring, dipshit. Go ahead. Locker room's down here on the end. How's it hanging? Hang back, boys. Motherfucker needs a doctor. Just dump him in an alley. Let nature take its course. You good now. Go on. How you, Neville? Where you at, I'll see. All right. I gotta go make the arrangements. Give them your name and such. You go on and get changed. Who you got with you tonight, LC? New guy. Yeah, new guy looks tough. But my money's staying on the brawler. I gotta ask you something, LC. What's that? Do all you niggas love beating the fuck out of each other? <laughs> nah, we'll beat the fuck out of any... So what happens if we get caught? Probably what you think. For a chance to go home again, it's worth it. No matter what happens, we should go. This is it. You nervous? Should I be? Guess that depends on where all this ends. You're gonna head through these doors and they announce your name. Then make your way to your corner. Where are you going? Oh, I'll meet you there. This part of the show is all about you. They love showing off their fighting niggas. Get in there, meat. And the jungle fights continue, boys! The next challenger to face Nick Boom Boom Beaumont comes in at over six feet tall, weighing approximately 220 pounds. This is Jack Knife Johnson! Had to start something. Ah, oh. 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 
Now, you head on back to the locker room and collect your winnings. Where are you heading? Me? I got business to attend to. You niggas really know how to brawl. Uh, my respect, that's for fucking sure. And you, you are gonna hurt like no one's hurt before. Fuck you. Guess you ready to die. You still be conscious as the flames creep up your legs. But as they burn, <coughs> you be hit in the gut with a sickening revelation. Before you... Gonna bury you! Don't tussle with a motherfucker on your side. We can work. 
work something out. Only thing needs working out of your funeral arrangement. Don't let me boy. Please. Say hello to Lou. Tell him Sal will be along shortly. Some covering fire in South Downs. Of course, you be there soon.
I need some covering fire in South Downs. No, sir. More away. Just a matter of time. Black bitch is mine. Got it! Get over here! God damn, I'm hit! We getting all that? Just allow me some backup! Put you down, son. Better one, boys. That's him. Let's go. Grabbing some cover. That's one of my boys. Get behind him. Fuck that. Hey. Switching out ammo! Found him! Yeah. <laughs> 
that fucking hurts. Your assholes unloading on me. Face to face. You and me, motherfucker.
<laughs> All hail the motherfucking king! Nice work out there. The entire goddamn city's buzzing about what we done to Makano. There's no one left to stand in our way. We run this city now. You're trying my goddamn patience, Lincoln. I don't come here to socialize and chat about politics. This is business. And outside of you asking me to lock down this goddamn territory, I'm not seeing hide nor hair of it. You got a plan for this territory, right? That's the only reason I can think of why you wouldn't call me. I appreciate you getting someone else to lock down this turf while I got shit up and running in our last district. But now I'm ready to take this part of the city, too. Let's finish this together. It's what Danny would have wanted. This turf's going to the Irish. I got big plans for this one, lad. And it starts with a statue of Marcano getting arse fucked by a goddamn badger. Holy Christ! How the fuck did we make it through this shite in one piece? I thought for a certain Scaletta would have his throat slit by now. It may not have all played out the way I would have liked. But we're here, and we're making money. And Lord knows, I'm a hell of a lot better at being alive than I am at being dead. I kinda thought I'd be gay to shit by now. So anything shy of that, and I'm good. Fuck. Fuck. You know how long I've been waiting for someone to stand up and be a man of his word? And in all my fucking days, you, Lincoln Clay, are the first motherfucker to do it. Thank you. You've done a hell of a job, Lincoln. Couldn't have done a better job myself. Probably. I, I halfway figured Lincoln would have killed us all by now. What we done here? Taking the city away from Marcana and doing it without killing each other? We gotta be proud of that. I'll admit it. I had my doubts, but no more. You came through just as you promised, and I'm lucky to be a part of it. We're living proof that the ways of Marcano, the lying, the backstabbing, the cheating, don't need to run in that direction. Those ways are as dead as he is. <laughs>